Bismillah Rahman Rahim. Dear viewers, today we will see how to create angle truss connection with column having I section. Like this. This is I section column. These three members are angle truss member. So this connection we will create in IDI Statica 10.1. So let's start. Run as administrator. Go to connection. We will start from scratch with this option blank project here we will write the name trust connection still great we will keep same as by default and design code we will use american design code now go for create project first of all we will save this project save here trust connection save now we will add member new member i section we will go for uc section 254 254 73 for example this angle we will give minus 90 degree as it is column in vertical alignment forces here we will provide in node now we will add another member new member here it is adding same member with the same property that's why it is overlapping so now we will change the section add angle section L member 55 you can ok now this one we will change the this angle to make it horizontal here this is having angle for upward direction so for example we will take 15 degree like this and EZ from this node if we consider this connection node in the middle of this plate then this truss is located above this middle point somewhere here so we will take some offset for example is it 200 model type here we will take for truss member we will consider axial loading now we will add another member downside from the middle point so minus 175 for example like this now we will add third truss member angle member like this one so add new member this one will be same before this this member 200 200 the angle will be minus 20 degree for example like this We have taken offset here 375 for example like this now we will add load later on we will adjust the connection with this column and its position we will adjust by changing the offset here first we will add load here m2 member see here here there is no bearing member for providing loading value so here whatever you keep that is not a matter so here for example we will provide loading 75 tension force axial load m3 25 sample loading so whatever it is coming from the analysis that one we will provide as input and we are considering this member in compression so minus 75 now we will add operation or connection new operation into plate like this click on ok member will be m2 this one connected to m1 
okay thickness 10 millimeter thickness this plate type bolted to profile 30 millimeter top from the joint left for example 100 millimeter bottom 475 millimeter right side for example 70 millimeter you can see now this plate is almost fitting okay here we can make it 25 this is okay 30 left 95 okay so it is now it's looking symmetrical on the column web okay now this ep top layers zero here 50 50 millimeter bottom layer for example 68 space 120 space we are relocating the bolt and increasing the number of bolt for example if i make it 60 it will be like this if i want to increase the number of bolt i have to add another distance for example 120 like this then another bolt row 120 another one 120 okay so this will be like this then right side layer for example 30 millimeter now this is okay and the weld we will provide here 4 milli 4 milli this is the weld between this connection plate and this truss member now we will go for another operation new operation member cut this one the member will be M4 and cut by M1 not M1 we will provide cut by the plate this one plate in plate ok in plate then the welding will provide for example 4 milli we can provide this side welding this side ok this one we can make it mirror like this because this horizontal plate of this truss member bottom side and this will be upper side so that it can hold the welding connection for the cross angle so now this ok this one we will reposition to get same this type of joint ok offset 10 milli is it 225 250 so this is this will be like this now we will add another cut copy this one m4 cut by member we can use cursor to to select this member now we can see there is welding also with this plate now this side we don't need so we will make this side connection 4 milli this is the welding now we will go for this angle add another cut cut 3 
this one member will be member will be m3 and plate then the angle will be both side okay we can adjust this one as the member of set 375 we can make it 370 350 325 okay so now it is almost same like this connection okay now we can go for analysis calculate here we can see the analysis done plate bolt weld everything passed if we want to check buckling we can check from here here stress strain and buckling okay stress if we want to see mesh the mesh will be generated deformed shape we can change the scale to see the deformation see here the deformation coming like this because here tension here is also tension but from this member compression is coming so here this is not going outward for tension this plate is going outward now we can generate report this is the report we can get bill of materials this one we can get the dxf from here for these plates and dimension okay so in this way we can design truss member connection with steel column having i section so thanks for watching stay tuned for more upcoming tutorials Press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update.